Oke, okay. welcome back to my channel Keep Learning. So, in this session, I will share to you uh, regarding the free process, chemical process simulation. So, as you can, uh, as you know that, uh, as a process engineer or chemical engineer, you have to do some process simulation. Uh, you have to do some process simulation. regarding doing your final assessment in your university on any other assessment in your work maybe so you have to do a great simulations of the software so maybe i am just to mention uh, what the kind of the software that the process engineer must know uh, maybe for the first one is Maybe it is S Pen. Yeah, S Pen. Hi, sis. <clears throat> or S Pen Plus. So I spend hi, sis, or S Pen Plus is not free license. So you have to buy some license to get the token of the S Pen hi, sis, and S Pen Plus. And I think this license is quite pricely. rather than an other software so you have to take out your money to your pocket to buy this license and then we have also the pipe sim the pipe sim and the pipe sim is the process simulation regarding the pipe modeling so you can use this pipe sim to simulate your pipeline maybe you can simulate the pipeline uh, with the pipeline networking so you have to observe and you you can know what the dynamic of your pipe flow pattern and i saw so and then the and then the third one is maybe this is the unisim and this uh, software unisim is the license unit is not free also so you have to buy some license to get this one and then the last one i want to introduce the free license software so this license uh, the name of this license the the name of this software is double d sim dw sim so it's free 100% free access so i'm going to uh, to know that is dw sim is 100 free access so how to get it started so i am um, i just want to explain to you all how you can get dw sim in this case okay so we have to go to the dvsim wait for a minute dvsim is the free license unit so you can download it as free and then you can use it for simulate your plan or your process simulation okay so you have to go to the web page of dw sim okay and then if you have to open dw sim.org as you can see uh, in this page you will find a lot of menu of this project so you can 
run this simulation also with website base so you don't need to download it first rather than you have to simulate it throughout the website and then maybe you can go to the download now so there are two version of dw sim uh, for this for this one i think is the license you need so you have to buy it to use okay but uh there is a free version for this one and then you can choose it uh, maybe if your software is wind is windows space you can choose it to download and then there is so for the apple you can do nothing also and then we uh, we can also the collaborate with python environment add-ons so i think it's very important for you guys that are very expert in python so maybe you can combine for the python base with your dw sim and then if you have to download it, maybe you can wait just for a minute and then you have to install it as the procedure standard. Okay, so maybe I just want to share what this is DWSIM. Okay, I, I will open the DWSIM. Okay, let's see. This is the first page for the DWSIM free license. So in this page, uh, you can see that uh, these, there are some of the modeling samples. It is very useful if you want to observe more what is the GW sim, there are dynamic simulation. So for our, for our older sample is free, so you can is so you can use it whenever you are. Okay, and then fossy flows it. So this is free also, so you can choose one. What will you want to simulate or modeling for the example? There is also the production of ICT as it using as a tally height synthesis of the methanol and also there are 251 simulation model that is free. Okay. Then we can go to the create new in the process modeling menu. And it will be directly go to the work workplace worksheet of this simulation, and then you will see the introduction. Maybe you can click the next. Okay, this uh like it's like uh some heises. So in this step, we we need to define what the compound that we need to simulate. Okay, maybe I just want to simulate the methane. You can just click it. Water. You can just click it. So the methane water has been, has added to your chemical list in the software okay and then you can go to the next okay is this, this is the main part the the important part that you need to do so this is the property packets if in the aspen high seas maybe you have the property packets like the bang robinson and all to all so in the software uh, in the software package you have 
you can see also for the NLTL Bang Robinson and also okay I will choose the Bang Robinson for property package so this uh, proper property package is one the equation that is kind of the equation of state that will predate it, uh, what the properties of your chemical compound so it is pretty important to see that you have to choose the property package will match which match with your uh, modeling so with modeling package also so you you don't so you have to be careful in this type okay i will choose the prime robinson because the prime robinson is very standard equation of state okay and then i'll go to the next uh, don't forget to add it and then i go to the next Okay, in this step, uh, you will choose the size system of the unit. So maybe if you want to international standard unit of measurement, you can just use I in here and English unit. Okay, I will choose the C1 because it's very familiar to me as a process engineer for the density in kg per meter cubic. Okay then click finish as you can see there are some of the menu okay and i'm just introduced to you that is the stream material stream you can just click and drag it to this one okay and then you you will see the pressure change it is included as the orifice, orifice plate, compressor, pipe segment, pump, turbine, valve, and also on. And then you will see the separator tanks, mixer or splitters, exchanger, reactor, column. This is for the solid handling. And then you, you will see this, the Python script. If you want to add the, some the Python script in your modeling to so this software, you can do this. And then logical block is like uh, for the control block, it's like just uh, adjustable block. So you can adjust what the parameter uh, by the manipulating parameter is the indicator. You can see this uh, analog gauge, digital gauge, and level gauge. This is PID controller. That's also the okay. Maybe I just want to introduce what to define the stream, and then I will choose. Just want to define it for the property package. I select. I select for the Peng Robinson. Okay. And in this step, maybe you can change what the mole fraction for the methane. I will fill with uh, 0 0.1. You can choose the basis of your calculation mole fraction or mass fraction, mass flow or mole flow. Okay, I will choose the mass fraction. Methane is uh, 0 0.3. Okay, maybe if you, you can also see like the normalize and then equal to all of this chemical compound to, to one because all of the sum of this chemical compound is must be one. Okay, that's good. You can. Accept. Okay. Okay. You can also change what your parameter process in here. Maybe like the temperature. You can input as the 40. And then click enter. 
Okay, I think it's it's always defined because you can see as the status in here, it's calculated by this date and the status is success. And then you can see as the resulted base properties for the mixture, the density is 1.61, thermal conductivity, molar entropy, internal energy, and also on. molar flow rate. You can also, for the vapor, and then you can see the vapor per small fraction is about 0 0.41. Okay. If you change this one to 120, Degree C. Ah, uh, is we change the vapor personal fraction to one because the, all of this term number has been vaporized in the one hundred twenty degree C. If I decrease it to thirty, and it will condense partially. Okay, I think that's all for this session. Uh, this uh, DW sim is very useful that you want to free your license so you don't need to buy some license maybe if you want to just uh, trial your uh, the basic of the process simulation I think DW sim is the best software that you want to okay I think that's all regarding this session I hope that uh, it will make it will help you for your task assessment in your university or your in your plan. Please give your comment below in my channel and don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.